हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू आवर चैनल जियो इजी प्लीज सब्सक्राइब टू आवर चैनल जियो इजी एंड प्रेस द बेल आइकन टू गेट नोटिफिकेशंस ऑफ मोर वीडियोस ओवर द नेक्स्ट फ्यू वीडियोस वी विल ट्राई एंड लर्न अबाउट द नेचुरल वेजिटेशन ऑफ इंडिया वी आर बैक विद यच नाथ एक्साइटिंग वीडियो ऑन द नेचुरल वेजिटेशन ऑफ इंडिया टुडे वी विल लर्न अबाउट द टाइडल फॉरेस्ट ऑफ इंडिया अंडर दिस वी विल ट्राई एंड कवर द क्लाइमेटिक कंडीशंस distribution of the forest the characteristic features of the forest and their economic value the tidal forest comprises of salt tolerant trees and shrubs the forests are found specifically in areas influenced by tide mud and silt gets deposited on such coast thus the tidal forest thrives best along the mud floods estuaries tidal creeks and tidal salt marshes Dense mangroves are the most common varieties found in such kind of a forest. Now let's have a quick understanding of what is a mangrove in detail. A mangrove is a shrub or a small tree that grows in coastal saline water. Mangroves are called salt tolerant trees or the halophytes. The mangroves contain a complex soil filtration system and an intricate root system to cope with the salt water immersion and the wave action. Mangroves occur worldwide in the tropics and the subtropical areas mainly between the latitude 25 degree north to 25 degree south. The total mangrove forest area of the world is approximately 137000 square kilometer, roughly the size of Greece. Interesting, isn't it? The largest amount of mangrove coverage is found in Indonesia, covering about 17% of the total. That's exactly the twice of the size of Jamaica. The mangroves in order to survive in this salty brackish water require a number of physiological adaptations to overcome the problems of low environmental oxygen level, high salinity and frequent tidal flooding. To deal with this the mangroves show often some distant zonations mangroves or the mangals protect coastal areas from erosion storm surge and tsunamis they are also effective in dissipating the wave energy a unique feature of the mangrove is that the root system of the mangroves provide nursing environment to thousands of fish species from a 1 inch gobby to 10 foot shark the mangroves are also an important source of blue carbon keep watching our videos to find more about blue carbon this was a short description of the mangrove forest coming back to the tidal forest they are well distributed along the deltas of the ganga mahanadi krishna and kaveri the saline swamps of sundarban in west bengal is perhaps known worldwide for its extraordinary beauty The Sundarbans is a mangrove in the delta formed by the confluence of Ganga, Brahmaputra and Meghna in the Bay of Bengal. It extends from the Hooghly River in India's state of West Bengal to the Baleshwar River in Bangladesh. The Sundarbans covering about 10,000 square kilometer is the largest contiguous mangrove forest in the world. The name Sundarban is derived from the word sundari which is a popular local tree of the forest. The area is known for its wide range of fauna including 260 species of birds, the world famous Royal Bengal tiger and other threatened species such as the estuarine crocodile and the Indian python. However, the tidal forest of India have a lot of unique features. Some of these are the trees have mainly evergreen species and are usually associated with wetness. The tree trunks have still roots which remain submerged under water during high tides. The forest have breathing roots called the pneumatophores. Pneumatophores are basically vertical roots that enable the trees to breathe when the other roots are submerged under saline water. The forest is home to a wide variety of trees such as the sundari, palm, keura, rhizophora and cane. The mangrove forest have high economic importance too. The trees are utilized for fuel. Sundari trees for example are known for its hard and durable timber. The unique halophytes are now identified as a world heritage site by the UNESCO since the year 1987. Also, the Sundarbans have been enlisted among the finalists in the new 7 wonders of nature. That's all for today. Don't forget to like, share and comment below. 
and stay tuned for more videos.